Hey, what's up, fish tank? I haven't seen you in a while. Looking good, though. Keep it up. Hey, good morning, everybody. I'm going off to run some errands right now. Look how beautiful it is outside today. Awesome. Okay, I just finished with the bank. Now I'm going off to the mall to check out a few things. Look at these socks. It's like padded. I've yet to see anyone wear these like neon stuff at the gym. Look, like they have iPads and Gap now. <laughs> Look at these shoes. Crazy. Look, there's a Nicki Minaj shirt. <laughs> I would never wear that. The song, I only miss you when I'm breathing. Come on now, hold your breath. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at that. I think hipsters need to wear that shirt. Mall is kind of boring today. Huh? And where did I park? Where did I park? Oh, right here. Yeah. Anything could happen. Anything could happen. Anything could happen. Anything could happen. Anything could. Cream cheese. Look, there's salmon flavored cream cheese and chive and onion. What? Just grabbing some bagels and cream cheese. Hey, what's up? I thought that I would do a quick question and answer session. You can always feel free to ask questions either on my Facebook page, you can tweet me, or even on the YouTube page in the comments below. And I decided to answer some of the more common questions that I got this time around. So the first one, which I always get, still, is, how tall are you? So the last time I checked, I was 5 feet and 11 inches. But I just went to the doctor, as you remember, like a couple of weeks ago when I was back in Hawaii, and I had a physical done, and it turns out I was actually miscounting, or I grew taller. I actually grew to 5 feet 11 and 3 fourths inches, which I was like, what? That's so awesome! And if you consider like my hair, which I usually spike up, and I wear sneakers, which you know increase the height a little bit, I actually kind of look like I'm over six feet tall, which is kind of crazy. Another question that people always ask is, what nationality are you? I'm fifth gen, and I'm mix of Chinese and Japanese. How much did your aquarium cost? Think of your worst nightmare for how much you'd spend on it, then double it and then you're halfway there, plus 1%. Okay, next question. How have you changed from college? I feel like I got a lot more introverted. I used to be super, super extroverted, which, which means like I used to be like super friendly with everybody. I was, I would like, in high school, I was like the class, um, I was like the class president and I did like every single thing. I was the editor of school newspaper, I was the head ambassador, I was head, um, head of the social services club, the Japanese club, like all these different clubs. Um, I knew every single person in my school. It wasn't too big of a school, but it was like about a thousand people or so. And yeah, I did everything. I got to know everybody, did everything. And then when it came to college time, I felt like Everybody in my school in college was kind of the similar way, so I kind of like, I feel like I kind of lost a little bit of the inspiration to like, and the drive to become more friendly with a lot of people. Visually, I guess I like bulked up a lot more here. I'll show you a picture of what I used to look like when I was in high school. See? Yeah, right? If I could go back to college and do it again, what would I do differently? And I really think what I would do differently is to be more friendly and get to know a lot more people and hang out with a lot more people. I hung out with a lot of people and I was really friendly but I feel like I could have done a lot more and got to know a lot more people and networked a lot more. That was my one thing that I would have changed. Anyway, those are the questions. Make sure if you have other questions, write it in the comments below. I'm heading off to the gym. Unfortunately, I'm not feeling that great because I still feel like I'm getting over something, so I'm not gonna go ham, but I'll try my best. See you there.
what's up? Back from the gym. Yeah. So I thought I would talk about something that a lot of you guys have been asking in the comments also, which was creatine and what my views on are on creatine. First of all, let me just explain what creatine is. If you don't know, it is a supplement that is naturally occurring. For example, if you eat fish, you're already getting creatine in your body. What creatine does is it actually causes your muscles to absorb more water, and so it makes your muscles look bigger. What else does it do? It also helps increase your strength. You'll be able to lift a little stronger. There's nothing wrong, it's just kind of like another supplement that you can take. It helps you get stronger and look more swole. Um, and I don't have anything against it at all. <laughs> do I take creatine? Well, I do take Cytogainer, and Cytogainer does include creatine inside of it, so... I guess I do take it. And on top of that, creatine doesn't really have any negative side effects other than maybe making your muscles bigger, which I don't see that would be a negative side effect. But one thing that it might be negative about it is when you stop taking creatine, it disappears from your muscles and so it just it'll just go away. But I highly suggest it, especially if you're trying to gain motivation, look bigger, or if you're trying to increase your muscle strength. I would just suggest maybe trying it for like a month or so and seeing if you like it or not. And then if you stop taking it, there's not really any harm done. It'll go away out of your system. Creatine also works a lot better when you take it with some like a sugar. Like if you pour it into your apple juice, a lot of creatine actually comes in like a sugary flavor already. But if you just take like the pure one, you might want to take it with like apple juice or like grape juice or something like that. The, another side effect is that you will gain weight because you'll have more water that goes into your muscles. One suggestion that I have is that when you take creatine, make sure to drink a lot of water. I can totally see where people are coming if they're against creatine, but there's nothing, there's nothing wrong with it. It's not like blood doping or steroids or anything like that. It's naturally occurring. You'll, you already probably have creatine in your body if you're eating regular foods. So this will just increase the amount of creatine in your muscles, which will increase your strength. That's your gym tip for the day. So check it out, I got this new tea thing, tea strainer. Instead of making using coffee bags with dental floss, which is so which is so ghetto. I got this, which is pretty cool. I got this for my sister for Christmas, but you see what you do is you stick all the, the loose tea in here, and then you let it steep, and when you're done, you stick it over the tea glass and watch. Magic! It pours into the glass. So cool. That means now I can use all my loose leaf tea that I have, that I've just been storing forever. Awesome! I'm grabbing some dinner now at the Chinese restaurant downstairs, so... Should be awesome. Sino, one of my favorite restaurants. It's so good. Aaron's got his counter burger. He went to the counter burger where I went to Sino. <laughs> Check it out. Wait, you got chicken salad. Chicken. It looks pretty good, I have to say. Here's my fried rice, which is, I like it. It's good. And I got some hot and sour soup. So, yeah. Hey guys, I'm headed off to bed, but before I do, I thought that I would re reflect on what I had said earlier about being more friendly with people because that's I think that's one very important thing because I know in college everyone tries to be kind of like show off and I have to admit that I did the same thing I wish that I was a little bit more open with them and I wanted to share this quote which I was like one of my favorite quotes by Dale Carnegie here it is you can close more business in two months by becoming genuinely interested in other people than you can in two years by trying to get other people interested in you. I think it's very true. And with that, I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.